granted. This is the personal audio log of Dr. Frank Serrano, dated September 19th, 2145. I've been brainstorming with thoughts about achieving sustained, uninterrupted transfers for the teleportation units. Currently, our systems can only build enough of a charge to have the portals open for approximately 10 to 15 seconds. It's enough time to get a team through, but not enough time to send in some of the heavier equipment. Engineering in the Inpro facility inform me that we can theoretically boost the active portal time to 45 seconds quite easily. But this will require rerouting power from central processing and we just can't afford the downtime. The power requirements for the system are astronomical. We're sucking power from three veins in Inpro just to power chamber one. I have no idea how we can sustain transfers for longer than 60 seconds without giving serious thought to reorganizing the teleport power. Destroy! This is Dr. Frank Serrano. This is the audio log of Administrative Assistant Han Lee, dated October 16, 2145. Decontamination Why chamber is it that sequence initiated. Armor Corps 1st Platoon and 1st Science team were completely wiped out this morning on their second excursion. And I am the one in charge of writing the reports and sending this information back to Earth next of kin. <sighs> so I have a first cup of coffee for the day. Five hours of sleep the night before, no shower, and I have 20 dead bodies to fill out paperwork on. I haven't seen the actual corpses, but word coming down from the grapevine says that it looks like they have been hacked up pretty good. He says everyone on the base spooked. The trooper is nowhere to be found, and there are a lot of questions being asked with no answers from anyone. 
Last I heard, they were suiting up the next outfit with the new BFG. Sounds like they weren't taking any chances on this next trip with them packing that kind of firepower. Decontamination process started. Decontamination complete. Have a nice day. This is the audio log of Administrative Assistant Han Lee, dated October 20th, 2145. Just when I thought this job couldn't get much worse, it did. Delta scientists sent another group of researchers through the portal two days ago and they failed to return at their scheduled time. Radio transmissions to the research body have gone unanswered. Even our LZ tracking systems can't find them. We fear that they are dead. Losing lives is one thing, but losing our proprietary technologies is another. The team was equipped with the newest BFG weaponry. We fear those guns may have fallen into the hands of those that killed them. We don't know who or what is behind that portal. But until we find out where our guns are, I'm suggesting we suspend operations of the portal. Thank you. End of log. destination. Pad 1 selected. Pad 2 selected. Decontamination process started. Decontamination complete. Have a nice day. My patience with you is wearing thin.
Access granted. Warning, chamber malfunction.
Please select teleport destination. Pad 3 selected. Decontamination chamber sequence initiated. Decontamination process started. 
Primary system failure. System shut down. Backup systems online. Stop him! Selected. Pad three. Pad one. Selected. Pad four. Select. Pad one. Selected. Pad two. Selected. This is the audio log of Dr. Martin Schultz, dated August 7, 2145. We need to amend the operating procedures to ensure that all target teleport markers are properly set and locked before engaging the systems. We had a tragic accident today in Chamber 1 that led to the death of Susan, one of our female chimps. She stepped onto the platform during the calibration phase, and an electrical short gauged the system and literally split her in two. Her torso appeared at the destination marker, while her lower extremities remained in place on the source pad. I'm not sure how we've gone this long without this problem appearing sooner, but it seems like we've been having nothing but difficulties getting these systems to work. Pad one, I don't know where Betrayer selected. finds the energy. He's been busy slaving away in the lab for 16 hours a day trying to debug these latest problems. What's he trying to do? Make the rest of his work in this look bad? Regardless, we have a work cut out for us over the next couple of days, going over all the system's logs to see exactly. Making progress, Marine? Your journey is futile. You will die, and your soul will be mine. <laughs> You will never find the thing you seek. It is trapped in hell forever.